How's it going everyone? I'm Contemption and today we're going to talk about the firework event. We're also going to talk about the hunt for history. We're going to go as far as we can in that and hopefully work towards the shield for the infantry legendary set. That is what we're going to get next. Um, so let's go over it. Happy New Year's to all of you. If you like these videos, please hit the like and subscribe and let's get into it. Okay, so here we go. We've got the fireworks event and right now we finished all of this. It was very easy to do. Alliance helps. Uh, I bought some of the stuff from the courier station for resources. I got all 10 from that one refresh. It was really easy. Uh, troop training was super easy. I was upgrading T4 to T5. I collected uh, archers, infantry and cavalry and I was finished. I got six from one and four from the other. So very easy to do on this event. Now, the Defeat Barbarian Forts is the most interesting one because there's not a cap on it. And I've been getting a firework for each level 15 barb fort I've been rallying. So let's just take a look at where we're... Oh, we already finished it. We already finished it. Did I get another one? I got another one. So every time I finish a level 15 barb fort, I've been getting one of these. So I think that is where you're going to really work towards these rewards now top five top ten probably going to the whales who are going to max by the bundle which is right here i'm not going to be touching the bundle i don't think it's worth it i'm going to try my best and use my remaining action points which is not a lot on just barbarian forts and we will continue to work on this now if i get in the top 20 i think the rewards are still decent you're getting three legendary sculptures. You're getting 300 gems. I think that's great for something that you're going to do anyways. I am going to use all my action points throughout this heroic anthem, trying to stay in top 20 to get that extra conquest coin. And I'll just show you right now where we're at. Rank 12. So I'm going to keep hammering at this. I'm not going to miss the ruins. I'm not going to miss the altar of darkness. We're going to keep going on that. So doing the barb forts is fantastic. We're getting honor, we're getting crystals, we're gonna get more uh, shop coins. So it works out for everyone. I've got 54 saved up. Actually, did I collect that last one? Let's collect that. Let's do 55, let's see what we get. And then we'll move on to the equipment event. Okay, so we got some action points, not even enough for a barb fort, but that's okay. Level 15 barb forts cost you know 290 to 300 action points fairly expensive we got some speed ups we got some resources um, nothing fantastic but they're free rewards you're getting these at least 30 a day if you just do normal things barb forts give you more i think it's great and then if we get some legendary sculptures from it as well i think that'd be awesome obviously we're not holding first for very long once those whales start buying the bundles um, we'll be dropping but that's okay um, that's pretty much the light up the night event for fireworks. It looks like it resets every day because you'll see the top three, 10 of 10 today. So I imagine tomorrow I'll be able to get 30 again and we'll just keep going on the barb forts, but let's move over to hunt for history. So we are working on some more frost dreads for our infantry marches. I'm still down one for that. So I need this and I need to specialize it. I have shios for the rest of it, but let's buy the 120 hammers i think it's awesome uh you know what i do want it to remind me but i will buy all of them so it's 24,000 gems to do this um for me that's you know five six days of gathering gems card up at the top i gather gems with most of my marches right now i have seven marches so i have five gathering gems all the time one or two for barbed forts or building flags whatever is needed so it's been working out really well. But let's do, we're gonna do auto again. I did auto the last time we did this event and it didn't work out so great, but I'm gonna try it again this event. So let's see how we do. I'd love to get to floor 15. I don't think we're going to. Floor 10 might be the farthest we get and then we'll save them, but let's see how far we get. So, uh, turn. yes, I understand. Remind me tomorrow. Let's see, oh. Yikes. 
auto not so good but let's yeah there was only two left there wow that was a lot okay and let's see if we can get better this time you know when you get it the first two or three clicks it's fantastic there you go fourth that's not bad that's good let's get to that floor five so we can get some once i get one shield for the legendary infantry set then i can unlock it and i'm going to move to either the gloves or the boots but we'll go over that when i get there um, let's dig again hopefully get to it quickly let's see oh man two from the end again Ugh. auto is not working out for me i think i'm going to be switching next time i'll stick with auto this time because i don't want to mess anything up but yikes wow that was more than halfway too okay but we're at four floor five let's grab the shield awesome this should be no problem unlocking hopefully it does it quickly but let's see how fast there we go fifth one not bad let's go unlock it we'll do that right now and then we'll figure out we should get to floor 10 fingers crossed if not i might just buy some more of those hammers let's go to actually you know what we're gonna go here because i have choice chests so i have 25 choice chests i'm gonna use them it'll be a while before i am able to craft another legendary set piece um, for weapons so let's combine that and now we got it now obviously I'm a ways away. I need quite a bit more material. So I'm hoping Holy Knight's Treasure comes up soon. I've had good luck with that for material. So hopefully we can get that coming up. Okay, so that's done. Awesome. That's a great pack. Let's see what we're going to do next. I think I'm going to do the one with the lowest amount that I have, which is the gloves, the boots. I'm still pretty low, but I got eight of them. So let's do the gloves next. I already have the um what is this the pants and the helm that's already finished so let's go in and do the gloves after obviously i have to get to floor 10 first but let's go back to frost treads we got one more of these and then we're going to work the infantry gloves because i have to specialize one more of those let's dig let's hope our luck changes because that was pretty rough okay auto there we go, six one, that's not bad at all. Let's switch over to the gloves. And that is Seth Brutality, so we'll select that. Dig. Eventually I'm gonna run out of epic gear to specialize, so I'm gonna have to do like the chest, which I don't think is great value, but it's the uh, fifth and 10th and 15th floor where you're getting the eight legendary fragments, which is just fantastic. That was a good auto. I don't think we're going to have any problems getting floor 10. I don't think it'll be worth it to try and go for 15. Auto, come on. Oof. Way more than half. That was like three quarters of it done. So that kind of stank. But that's okay. We're definitely going to get to floor 10. And that was the goal. Um, we're not going to get any of the bundles for the hammers. Wow. I'm definitely not doing auto again next time not worth it okay let's go and grab the gloves so that is infantry defense van braces of the eternal empire let's start unlocking that it's going to be a few of these before i have it but i should have no issues getting this set ready for next kvk i'll dig all right now let's hope we can save as many as possible for next time this event comes because they save and that's awesome so we have it we're gonna stop there that's good enough for now i don't need anything else from that event um it'd be great to you know try and get to floor 15 i probably could but it would cost money and i i you know what with the crystal tech that we had for this heroic anthem recharge and all that stuff i think i'm just gonna leave it this time we do have some other events not going to push. I'm not going to get the stars on this. I don't think it's worth it. I don't have a lot of speed ups. 
Um, but that's it. That's the New Year's event. If you're wanting to compete on this and get some legendary sculptures, I do suggest defeating Barbarian Forts. Um, that is probably your best bet to get a higher rank. Uh, obviously, if you have a lot of whales in your kingdom, you might just want to skip it, save your AP, especially if you're not in KVK. But there are options out there. So um, thanks for joining me, guys. Again, if you like these, please hit the like and subscribe. It really helps. Trying to get to that 1,000 subscribers. It's a long journey, but we will get there. So until next time, guys, which I'm sure will be soon, have a good one. Happy New Year and see you soon.